Hmm, I wonder if Halo Infinite is gonna steal again from Doom Eternal. <laughs> this heretic and those who follow him must be silenced. This slander offends all who walk the path. That's of course a joke. Camioneta, maldita sea. I love Doom, but I also love Halo. Let's get into it. If you wanna play Halo Infinite on PC, but you do not have a gaming rig, be sure to buy one from my PC lineup. Click the link down below in the description if you're interested and use code MIDNIGHT for a huge discount. Thank you so much for the support. Enough talk, Halo Infinite, Doom fanboy, let's go. Embrace monkey, kill him. Jackals, all right. Oh, ho, ho, what's up, Jega and Eshroom? That's awesome. Okay, bro hammer. The I love surprise you. surprise I had coming out of my few hours of okay. playing Halo Infinite's campaign wasn't the delightful exploration nor the incredibly fun gunplay. Well, Instead, it's Halo, it's it fun gunplay. Alright, that's awesome. The legendary Master Chief once again tasked with saving Little booty, I love you. Another threat. And after five major campaigns, the Chief seems tired. He's a man of few words, but his well, that... responses are heavier than I've seen before. That makes sense, he's this like, what, 49? 49, 50 years old. Change is far from a bad thing, though. If anything, Master Chief's forlorn demeanor that he sets aside to get the job done is a great indication to me that Halo Infinite's story is intended to be a more impactful adventure. Well, he's a man of few words, and he takes action. But still, it makes sense because he's like 50, but Johnson died when he was 80 years old. It's been yeah. six years, where have you been? God damn it. Chief's stern determination is also wonderfully contrasted to his new AI companion's bubbly enthusiasm and his pilot rescuer's anxiety. Oh, bro, Hammer. If you die, Even I'm gonna die too. Three industries failure to give Locke the faintest hint of a personality or motive in Halo 5 <laughs> and the game's generally lack of story. <laughs> the burn, man. The burn. No, no, no. Not, then. Not, again. Not again. Not fire Timo Cyrus. I need a weapon. Oh! <laughs> He said the word. He said the word. Halo Infinite's contrasting oh. characters aren't. I do not keep it loaded, though. son. You have Rewarding to find ammo where you go. Confused with Halo's DNA and genuinely challenging combat. Hey, wait, that's what's that weapon? Open world game extravaganza. What's an awesome where weapon? Many worlds are packed to the brim. Dude, with tours, this Halo ring is awesome. Adventures beyond their main path. I hope I this is not the full map, though. I want more exploration. I think Halo Infinite could fall into the latter. That's not to say there aren't some essential elements of Halo Infinite. I love the design of the elites return to form. They look like Halo like 2 Chief's elites. Storyline with Cortana. For now, what I played in my preview session has left me what? even more eager for Halo Infinite's December 8th launch. Halsey Hulse, was giving Cortana the chip. Isn't that the 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 scene from Overo oh, Hammer? Wait. He has the grapple shot already? I think it, it is. Yeah, that scene is from Halo 4. Has woken up to fight a new enemy. Halo Infinite was received that pulled back by I love the design of the brutes. Hands down, my favorite design from all Halo games. Oh, Eshidum with a Kukri with the knife here on his right shoulder blade. Halo, including Master Chief. Their goal for Zeta Halo is unknown, but if it involves a Halo ring, there's nothing good that can come of it. Of course, After it's a goddamn Halo lost, ring. Master Chief's main objective becomes freeing the captured allied forces on Zeta Halo and thwarting whatever the Banished are planning. I yeah, you bet. I'm going to save War all Chief my... Of the War Chief of the Banished. Dude, I love Cortana that shot of Master Chief, like, alone in darkness. In what I played. What happened to her after Halo 5 and whether or not she's been truly destroyed is unknown. This crucial conflict seemingly takes a backseat to the larger fight with the Banished, though it is intertwined somehow. Without right. getting into spoilers, I will say the few moments that dug into Chief and Cortana's relationship were an emotional gut punch. Of course. Halo Infinite is looking to deliver a meaningful story for legacy Halo fans, and I really needed to fulfill that promise after Halo 5's story missteps. She's not the driver. Yeah, that scene is from Halo 4, the intro where Halsey gives Cortana to Master Chief. She named herself. Yeah, that's that's got to be like Chief's point of view. Uh, I miss I miss you so much, Cortana. I'm optimistic that Halo Infinite is going to be a great starting point for new people to the franchise. Say what? The best moments I saw in the first few hours rely on prior knowledge of the series. 
I well, don't like the idea oh, that's, of that's staying Aatrox. behind, but I selfishly prefer that this game is made for returning Halo fans rather than tuning the story to accommodate new players. Well, Familiar with the story or not, though, Halo Infinite sure is fun to play and explore. Well, it, with you. it is a I sequel. I banished was an hour ago, and even I can see the odds aren't great. Well, it is a sequel for a past Halo title, so it, it is made for Halo fans, so that might make sense. And also, the weapon's voice Brian actor rem reminds me to Cortana's too. One moment you're navigating encounters in ship corridors, then the next you're driving several marines around the open fields of Zeta Halo. Yeah, let's As let's rock, Marines. marines. As stated, Halo Infinite isn't quite a true open-world game, despite it featuring massive sandboxes. Well, it's not Red Dead Redemption or Far Cry, so it's teams. a linear campaign. Brain masses can be connected by bridges, and Chief can eventually call in things like a wasp to fly around anywhere. I wonder if Rohammer gives so you the wasp or drops you the weapons. Areas, but our range will be limited and more focused at first. Zeta Halo is littered with UNSC camps called Forward Operating Bases that were claimed by the Banished after the UNSC lost the big fight. I want to see the big fight. In reclaiming it replaces the Banished with Marines. I hope we can in see like a cutscene of the big fight or something. Fast travel points and earn you Valor. Where oh. Not, Valor isn't some sort of spendable currency. Oh. It's instead All a right. point based tracker of how much ground the UNSC has on Zeta Halo. The more Valor you have, the better backup and gear you can call in. Oh, as so you can recover can your camps. Valor and reclaiming the broken ring is entirely optional. You so bet I'm going to reclaim the whole ring the with my Marines. Plan. People don't just get to give the Master Chief a fetch quest. The All only right. one who really gives Master Chief any sort of command is a new AI code named The Weapon. She's meant to destroy Cortana and is in turn supposed to be destroyed when her operation is complete. Oh, uh, that, 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 that sucks, the dude. Remains and is well, happy what's that ship Chief on the background? She her eventual demise. Is that a cruiser? Much like Cortana, the weapon will call out enemy attacks, notable objectives, banished facilities that need destroying, and marines in need of rescuing. All right. I was more likely to come across a random patrol of enemies than an actual objective, but I didn't feel like I had to go too far to find something fun to do. I enjoyed the quiet moments, though. Following Zeta Halo's native Hey, wildlife! Just enjoying the view was a pleasant reprieve from Dude, the Dude, this Halo- This Halo ring though, looks awesome! I could also hunt down and eliminate special targets to collect a unique version of their signature weapon that's equivable at FOBs. And of course, there are plenty of collectibles. A new scanner tool does make them a bit easier to find. Well, that reminds me to Halo 4's scanner, scanner for multiplayer. Limited, so it's not a free pass to finding secrets. I'd be remiss I don't if like I that, you can, that you can scan the area for collectibles. They're hilarious. They're supposed to be the like... The are as silly and oddly aggressive as ever, and have a surprising number of lines. You okay. Would never fight like us. He's here! <laughs> the Marines are far more confident and excited about joining He's the here. battle. Their commentary made exploring all the more enjoyable. Just in the nick of time, Chief. Uh, for some reason, I love the design of the Marines, and seeing Marines without the armor, it looks it's so refreshing. Zeta Halo is a larger, more open sandbox doesn't mean 343 suddenly has us doing puzzles or tasks unbecoming I love of a life in this game. super soldier like Master Chief. I love Mangus Fighting too. Fighting enemies and destroying their stuff is always at the center of Halo Infinite's <laughs> gameplay. And whether I was taking on a roaming pack of Banished, or infiltrating a fortress for a story mission, the more open nature only served to give me more options for combat. What's that grunt doing? Awesome AI 3 for 3. <laughs> if oh. you've had a chance to check out either of the multiplayer test flights, Halo Infinite's excellence in weaponry should come as oh, a no. surprise. The campaign oh, no. introduced me to other interesting Wait, what's that weapon? Yet to see in multiplayer, like a shock disruptor. pistol? A small disruptor. pistol that doesn't do too much immediate damage, but deals up pain over time. I wonder if it's for shields the or something. We've seen in multiplayer, oh, tons of upgrades. Let's go. Form in the campaign. Each of the Spartan five cores. Options, grapple shot, shield core, threat sensor, drop wall, and thruster can be upgraded with a collectible called Spartan cores. Like most of the open world Okay, so Spartan cores are for Spartan upgrading your upgrading equipment, is optional. equipment. Master Chief won't start the adventure with all equipment either. Of You'll course find not. new tools to play with at specific story beats. That makes sense, Blacking too. Blocking a piece of equipment doesn't necessarily mean you're blocked off from certain areas from what I saw. Mm, but interesting. But getting or taking on difficult encounters might be more manageable should you have more equipment. I wonder if you can get, like, to certain parts of the game only using, like, an upgraded grapple shot for collectibles, I don't know. That'll be great. Challenge fit to be a Spartan. 
Spartans. Most of the big story beats happen in large foreboding structures that could be viewed as something akin to dungeons. These All offer right. more classic Halo dungeons. experience. Grunts, jackals, brutes, and elites made up the bulk of the opponents I faced. Their role, weapon, and armor variety didn't feel lacking in combat. I came across one set of brutes that were so geared up they nearly qualified oh, as a mini boss. Neuron activation and brace monkey. To to, <laughs> and they're fun to fight as always. Hunters. This being another ring, the flood was alluded to, though I never whoa, saw them. What? The Prometheans whoa, 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 Pause the video, pause the video. What? What? The flood were alluded to? Well, it makes sense. This is a new Halo ring, set a Halo from part of the original array of Halo rings. So, come on, please, please, 343, three, give us the flood. I, I need to hear that again. Mini boss fight. The hunters make a return to and hunters, are fun to fight as always. Of course, we saw them already. This being another ring, the yeah. flood was alluded to, though I never saw them. Dude, oh, hearing the flood in a Halo Infinite video, it, I, I want to see the flood. I want to see the flood. It's been 14 years. 14 years since we since we fought the flood in a mainline Halo game. Yeah, yeah, we saw them in the Awakening Nightmare in Halo Wars 2, but. That's not an FPS, it's an RTS, and it's not the same thing. I want to see the flood in this new engine, the Sleep Space engine. Ah, oh, they're gonna go they're gonna look so good, but anyways, let's uh, The Prometheans weren't present either. Thank Bring goodness the vision of recapturing the essence of combat evolved in Halo Infinite means there's not really room for them. And yeah. honestly, I have plenty of fun without them. Yeah, I me didn't too. See any drones either. I didn't so like I'm the Prometheans the in Halo 4 and 5. Hard light weapons, the skimmers, will they be felt so replacement. so spongy. The real combat stars, though, are the boss fights. Oh, alright. The first one with a brute lieutenant named Tremonius absolutely Tremonious. kicked my ass at first on heroic difficulty. A moment heroic. without movement rewarded okay, so this is heroic as difficulty. he entered the encounter guns blazing and took me out twice in a row. I had been handling heroic without any issues up until that point. It doesn't so look that hot. to see how Tremonius' aggression and support from two jackals paid off. I quickly got to work on a strategy and happily took on the challenge. Alright. On the right track, okay. Boss fights. I have thus far only explored a fraction of Halo Infinite. Please. Though the map isn't as large as something you'd find in an Assassin's Creed. Far from it. Of course it, not. What it does hold seems to offer something more curated with excellent combat at its heart. The story part is what I'm most curious oh, about. I'm gonna now. cry. 343 needs to stick the landing in the plot department. Especially with regard to giving us a satisfying resolution to the Chief and Cortana's relationship. Of course, if I agree. If they can finally deliver that well-rounded classic so much. Halo experience, then they'll have successfully and definitively made Halo their own. For yes. more on Halo Infinite, check out our exclusive reveal of the new Streets Wait, multiplayer what? map. It's already over? All November what? For more IGN first coverage on Master Chief's latest adventure. It's already over? It felt like 3 minutes, it was 11 minutes of gameplay. Jump! Why do you always jump, Chief? No. No, please, no. <laughs> okay, so three main things I want to point out in this video. Uh, how Chief handles himself, he is older. He feels more bigger, more heavier. And I can somewhat agree on that because he is what, 48, 49, I think 50 years old. Uh, so it makes sense that he's getting like heavier, older. He's more uh, trying, moving like an, an old man. But Johnson died when he was 80 years old old he died on my birthday actually the 11th of december so yeah johnson died when he was 80 and he was a unit so i wonder why how, why master chief is slowing down or something like that i don't know second the open world mechanics of course halo infinite is not gonna be red dead redemption 2 assassin's creed far cry blah 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 at its core halo infinite is a linear campaign exploration game i don't know i don't have a script so I'm going from my mind if you didn't notice but yeah I can understand why it's not like a 100% open world game but it's fine what I want to see though is I wonder if this is not the whole map of the halo ring I wonder if this is only like a one third or one fourth of the map because she didn't play the whole game this is just like four hours into the game so 
let's see how it goes and last but not least the flood i want to see the flood this is a new halo ring and if my halo lore goes correctly every halo ring has like a sort of i don't know hidden xperia is going to completely die when i say this but i think every halo ring has like a sort of laboratory a lab where they keep like flood forms inside of them i don't know i have no idea but halo ring halo ring has flood let's see if we can see the flood but anyways god damn it Halo Infinite comes out the 8th of December, three days before my birthday, and it's gonna be the biggest birthday present I've gotten from Halo. It's gonna be awesome. Oh, beautiful, beautiful. I want to play it already, I want to play, I want to play. But anyways, my friends, have an awesome day, stay safe, adios, bye.